Hi everybody, this workout is a Coach Tam and Coach Ali mashup. You will need a weight plate and a pair of dumbbells to complete this workout. We are squat pressing for this exercise. Start standing with your arms at your chest and your elbows tucked by your side. Squat down and extend your arms at the same time. Feel the core contraction as you extend and drop your body weight. Return by standing back up and pulling your hand back to your chest. Let's do as many reps as we can for this next set. Your go. This exercise is Halo. Start standing with soft straight knees and neutral spine. Extend both arms out horizontally in front of you to get started. Draw a circle around your head with the weight plate, finishing with your arms extended back in front of you. Switch directions with each Halo. Let's get you guys to try this exercise. For this exercise, we're combining close grip presses and chest flies. So we're going to start off hitting a close grip press, making sure those elbows are tucked in and pushing straight up. And then we're going to keep the arms soft straight when we go into the chest fly. Nice moderate pace movement for both exercises and they just flow from one to the other. Your turn to have a go. This exercise is bicep hammer curls. Hold the plate grips palm to palm and extend your arms down until they are straight. Curl up without moving your elbows. Keep your knees slightly bent and your spine neutral to protect your back. Let's do this for the next minute.
Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Thank you.
uh, this exercise we're combining a neutral grip press with some skull crushers. So we're going to push up with parallel arms into that press. And once your arms are pointing right up, we're going to go straight into the skull crushers by making sure we keep the elbows stationary and dropping the arms back parallel. Then we're going to start from the beginning and we're just going to flow from one exercise straight to the other. Bent over rows. Start this exercise similar to a deadlift by bending your knees and posturing forward with a neutral spine. Now keep legs static and pull up rows from here. Keep your elbows tucked in by your side and have steady control over your up-down movement. Your turn to try it. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Thank you. 
Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Single arm row, nicely supported by the bench for this one. So very important, just release the dumbbell until your arm's nice and straight. And then when you pull it up, you want to pull towards your rib cage with your elbows tucked in. Keep your wrists nice and straight and keep your spine neutral as well. Both sides, your turn. This exercise is a front delts raise. Standing with your feet at shoulder width apart, raise your extended arms in front of you until you can see beneath your weight plate. Drop your soft straight arms back down in a steady and controlled motion. Neutral hand grip position and protecting your wrists throughout the motion. It's your turn to try this set of front delts raise. <laughs>
Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Thank you.
deltoids combination for this one. So we start off with a front delts raise and then we're going to move it across to a crucifix position or a lateral delts if you like. And then we bring it back out to the front with soft straight arms and release. Then you start from the beginning. Now make sure that you've got a slight bend in your knees and that you're holding a neutral spine. Your turn to try this one. Overhead tricep extension. Start standing tall with your feet at shoulder width. Extend your arms up until they are straight above your head. Curl your arms back down to your head and extend back up without moving your elbows. Steady controlled movement is key for this tricep extensions. Your turn. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Thank you. 
first exercise is a chest press that starts from a neutral hand position with your elbows tucked in. And on the way up, it rotates into what looks like a regular chest press. Now, make sure your back is pinned right up against the bench when you do this, and it's a vertical push up. Your turn to try it. Weight plate thrusters for this exercise. Start with your feet parallel and shoulder width apart. Drop into your squat while pressing the plate into your chest. On your way up, add a shoulder press at the top of your squat, then start over from the beginning. Your turn. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Thank you. 
considered shoulder press for this exercise, but this is a little bit different. So you can see that it starts with a neutral hand position with your elbows tucked in. And as you lift, it rotates and looks more like a traditional shoulder press for this one. Make sure your spine remains nice and neutral. Keep your chest proud and protect your back through this exercise. Your turn. Well done for getting through this challenging workout. Please take a few minutes to stretch and cool your body down before finishing. Comment and let us know what you thought of the workout and remember to subscribe for your daily workout fix.